Morning for Kids first, and today I'm reviewing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem is a breath of fresh air, and certainly the best Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie so far. This animated rendition of everyone's favorite turtles is oozing with distinctive and eye-catching graphics and upbeat music. This movie dives deep and expands on the personalities of the characters we all know and introduces us to new mutants that I love. Although it has a predictable plot, it is certainly enjoyable and appealing to kids, teens, and adults. After many years of hiding from the human world in the sewers, Leonardo, Nicholas Cantu, Raphael, Brady Noon, Michelangelo, Shaman Brown Jr., and Donatello, Micah Abbey, want nothing more than to be accepted as normal teenagers. They find that the only way to do this is to save New York City. They plan to take down the notorious villain Superfly, Ice Cube, and be hailed as heroes. Easy enough, right? This movie milks the strengths of the franchise with an updated view. It's great for all ages, but I feel it caters the most to a teenage audience. It uses current slang such as sus and riz, which made me laugh, music, and pop culture. Director Seth Rogen's creativity in this movie really elevates it. Compared to the other turtles seen in previous installments, the turtles here feel way more like actual teenagers. Even Master Splinter, Jackie Chan, feels more genuine and like a dad. Some of the best performances in this movie come from Nicholas Cantu, Leonardo, Brady Noon, Raphael, Micah Abbey, Donatello, Michelangelo, Shaman Brown Jr., and Ayo Abruri, April O'Neil. The dynamic of the Turtle Brothers is one of my favorite parts of this movie. April is very realistic because she just wants to be accepted and to get through high school. She's also very relatable to me personally because she's a journalist and trying to make it out there in the world. There's also some big star power in this movie, represented by Ice Cube, Maya Rudolph, Giancarlo Esposito, Rose Brin, John Cena, Paul Rudd, and Post Malone. Master Splinter, voiced by Jackie Chan, is one of my favorite characters because he's so endearing. Make sure to stay for the pre credit scene. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem displays that love for friends and family overpowers even the worst evils. This movie also deals with acceptance and bias and demonstrates the importance of not judging a book by its cover, or shell. Another idea demonstrated is don't let the haters get to you because you can't really hide from the world in a sewer for the rest of your life. There's some mild profanity and actions that are risky for children, like being ninjas. I give Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem 4 out of 5 stars and recommend it for ages 8 to 18 plus adults. This movie comes out in theaters August 2nd, 2023. This is Catherine reporting for Kids First. Please don't forget to subscribe to Kids First and check out all of our reviews and interviews. See you later. Bye!